So I'm here with three women pressing for a change, and what what change are you pressing for? And well, we focus on um, the issues that are prominent at a time. Today, the the um, the issue that we're we're pushing pressing for is making sure that people are registered to vote. Uh, 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 Roxanne here has. Um, is, is eligible to register voters. Of course, we're women pressing for change. Our focus is women, and we want to make sure women understand they have a voice. And we're push, pushing for women to vote especially right. because we feel that change cannot be made without women's support. That's right. and our signs say vote for the children, vote for the country, vote for our future, and that women need to be involved in making those decisions. So, how did you all meet and why did you decide to, to do this at the farmer's market? Well, the traffic at the farmer's market. <laughs> <laughs> we all met at the 99% spring training that was the action uh, step of the Occupy movement. That was in April of this year? It was year. in April of this year and we, we talked a lot about um, how, uh, how we could affect the changes that we felt were needed in the country. And um, Louisa, who is not here, came up with the idea we ought to bring our ironing boards and our irons out into the street uh, because we are working women. We uh, want to support women who work in all kinds of jobs. And uh, also there's a visual effect. People are very curious. And that way we can start to talk to them about what we're interested in. Our goal would be to have... A hundred women pressing. Yes. And so we would like to invite all women to join us. If they don't have an ironing board, we'll find one. <laughs> Are you here every Saturday? No, the, the farmer's market gave us permission to come uh, once a month. So we'll be here again in October. But we're looking for other events. We um, pressed at the City Hall in Albuquerque for press to amend for the constitutional amendment to stop Citizens United, uh, all the money going into the election, so we supported that. Movement. Can you talk more about that and talk a little bit louder? And we were pressing to um, support a resolution introduced into the Albuquerque City Council to support the amendment to the Constitution to um, take away the power of Citizens United and get the money out of the elections, and so we're we supported that issue. Um, we're supporting issues of the day. So, we'll what's the status events. of that resolution? Is that um, passed? It got voted down on party lines in the Albuquerque City Council. So you gotta wonder. <laughs> it failed. Oh, however, the state of New That's Mexico right. is one of the first states that did pass a resolution <laughs> sent to Congress to get them interested in, in putting it forth an amendment. And that there, Hawaii, Vermont is one. Yeah, yes. And there's seven states. There's seven states in Hawaii. So we are forward looking in that respect. What do you think about the effort to raise the minimum wage in Albuquerque? Great idea. It's a great idea. It needs to happen. It's unfortunate that they had the problem with the getting it on the ballot. So hopefully it goes through next time. <laughs> is there any other issues that you're cons working on or concerned about? Well, we're concerned about all the issues of the 99%. We feel part of the 99%. So right now, uh, we feel it's best to just focus on one or two ideas at a time. And so right now, because it's election season, voting and getting women to vote is very important to us. Great. You know, sometimes, um, and I, I don't know if everyone shares this, but sometimes I feel that there are too many groups uh, working for the same thing. And one of the things I think we want to do is support the groups that are really focused on the issues like voting, voting rights, voter suppression issues that are going on, and then the move to amend. I mean, that Citizens United decision has to be turned around if we're going to survive as a country, as talk far as the, I'm concerned. <laughs> talk about the Ben and Jerry's uh, uh, stampede uh, oh, yes. for change, or stampede, stampede for, for change. America. Um, ben Cohen, who is, uh, of course, no longer the CEO, but was the founder of Ben & Jerry's, um, has started a movement uh, where they have built a, a van called the Vendomatic Machine, and they are going to be starting to move across the country um, next month, first week of next month. And um, what they are doing to raise the uh, consciousness of people about the amendment 
to turn around the Citizens United decision. They have these stamps where you can stamp money. Yeah, yeah. And there, there are three of them. One of them I have says, two. not to be used for bribing politicians. <laughs> the other one says, the uh, system is not uh, A corporation broken. is not it's a person. Fixed. Money is not speech. Yeah. And no. the third one, of course, the main, the primary mantra, corporation is, is, not, a is not a person and money is not speech. So, We've so chanted that a lot at Al Occupy marches. I've been part so of some of those. we stamp money, and if you want any money stamped, we are here to help them. Stamps. Yeah, the band's coming to Albuquerque, like I saw on the map, October 16th, I think. Oh, maybe. is that when it is? It'll be here overnight in Albuquerque, so we're hoping to host it or a, we'll have some kind of event when they arrive in town supporting the move to amend again. Where can people get those stamps? Is there a website? It's um, move, give to amend move to amend.org. And for $20, I think, each a stamp. Do you know they're having a regional conference, I believe up in Denver, in November, Move to Amend? Yes. Yeah, I have yes. heard that. And also in Santa Fe, there's a group called the We Are People Here oh, right. Coalition. They're starting, trying to start the uh, the real, the Alliance for Real Democracy, oh, okay. which would, would be, hopefully be a coalition of different groups who all come together on getting, or ending the plutocracy. Right. Getting money out of politics. Right. Uh -huh. That's what we like to see. And we yeah. support all of those efforts. That's right. And we'll be there. So I'm going to get a shot of your other... We vote for the country. Final word? So we're portable. We can be a portable demonstration. And they even have flags. We even have flags. We are patriotic. We love our country. And sure. We want to do what we can to help it survive. <laughs> help democracy survive. We're concerned about the money in politics. So. Thank you for being out here. You're welcome. Oh,